Welcome back, everyone. Thank you so much for joining, and I really greatly uh, appreciate your support you've shown to this entirety of Corporate Clash that I've done for quite a while now, both with uh, Hans and my um, Uber project that I'm currently working on. And I'll start today by saying I finally figured out something. So I'm hoping to have these uploaded kind of like, you know, in order of how I made them so it's like calendar wise it's easier to show this way so like typically like on Fridays it's when I uh, make the uber series type stuff and then uh, you know on Thursdays is when I do the pods stuff you know just try to make it simple on myself you know for now at least so in other words like I'm, you know you Hoping to do a lot of the upload, a lot of the Uber stuff first, first, you know, several episodes of that, upload some of these HOTS type ones, which, if you're watching now and you've seen, you know, the other ones, those are already up there, but I'm just kind of explaining how that process kind of works and such. But uh, where I wanted to go with this, though, is the fact that several past episodes have just been kind of like... Yeah, I've been trying to make groups on HQ, and I'm like, oh wow, like, you know, there's never any groups, and I'm on several times a day, you know, like, different times, you know, varying times, obviously, and, uh, it just doesn't, uh, work, you know, I'm not able to find a group for certain things. Well, the other day... I found out that there are groups here, and this is how people have been doing it ever since the update. I, you know what, and I honestly don't know. I may have heard that there were groups on here, you know, through this, or I may have already seen it, but for some reason it just never clicked that I would be that it would all have to be done on here. So I've been struggling with, you know, trying to get stuff done. Here, it turns out, I've completely been ignoring this. And what got me to think about it was that I was in the official uh, corporate clash, you know, Discord server, and someone was having like a pizza party or something. Here, let me show you, we can walk down that way. And, you know, I saw them, you know, because it had like 20, about 20 people, you know, at that time. And I'm like, oh, wow. And so I was trying to join it, you know, see what all the fun is about. Here, it wasn't quite work, you know, like I couldn't find it. It wasn't on HQ, because that's where I kept looking. Here, it turns out, it was being made through the game. Right there. Now this is a suspicious looking building because... Uh, welcome, I'm your major D tonight. But no, you got, you know, all these tables and such, you know, at the pizzeria. You could sit down, which is awesome and enjoy of the stuff. But it makes you think, why would we need oil, gas, antifreeze, now diet oil, you know, I've tried to watch my figure, so I need the diet oil, but like, why would we need those types of things? Unless if there was something suspicious going on back here, which I honestly have no idea what that's going to be, but it also makes you kind of wonder, why is there... So this is supposed to be like a pizza oven. Yeah, and it looks like icicles. And here you have like a whole bunch of dough, which is kind of funny because dough and dough. And... But yeah, it's just kind of funny. I don't know, this pizza parlor looks more like a cash bot front to me. I don't actually know if it is, but it's just kind of funny. That's what it looks like. So anyway, 
Long story short, though, off camera, I was able to duck shuffler not bad at all. Very nice people helped me out with that. Uh, they're very nice. And they do all the, you know, because they've done it several times before. They've said, and they were all like, oh, yeah, this is the strategy you use for this. And it's not really all that involved. It's mainly a lot of, like, blur and throw. Wait, what did I do? Wait a minute. Whisper? Really? What does that do? Emote, club shout. Oh, club shout. We could just start shouting. Log out, teleport. That's weird. I mean, that, not weird, but like, I did not know how I did that. I was trying to press where do I go for this silly street. Okay. Oh yeah, so that's how I've been doing. I finally figured out that you make groups on here. Because, anyway, but yeah. So I find that really cool. I like that. For me personally, like when I'm recording here and such, it's, uh, it's one less tab I need to have open. So I can keep you know, more tabs on fewer tabs. If you get what I'm saying. So yeah, to have more tabs on something is like, you know, to be able to check in more on, but basically so that way it's like I'm only watching. Oh wait, what's this? Oh, that would be so cool. Become duck pose. Yes. You're doing great. Be sure to put those rubber ducks in the soup, by the way. Those would... That would be really awesome if you could do that. Well, glad I could help. So now we're actually going to head back to the playground. Let's take a look at the kudos. Yeah, we're at rank 5 now. Which means we're approximately halfway, because I'm basically just going to try and get to rank 10 at all the playgrounds. First rank 10 uh, task is basically just like getting those extra gumballs. Which I wonder if I could eat those. I probably could, if I really wanted to. See, there's certain ones where it's like on wacky way, but I'm not gonna really get a lot of experience out of that, I don't think. So we could go with 10 cogs, 8 cogs, 44 gag experience, that sounds pretty good. And to feed 6. 6 cogs. And we could just head. I don't know, anywhere, really. As a fun part of task, anywhere actually means anywhere. Try to find something. Here we go. Let's do crutch. Sounds good to me. The set has not been sponsored by Nestle, so you can't really say any other types of candy bars at this moment or time. Bit, though. But yeah, I might actually take a look at groups on here periodically, kind of like through, which is awesome too. You get to kind of look at uh, this 
as like your bad like it's such a so you could prepare oh this is awesome so we could do a senior VP see so yeah look there are like there are a lot of good groups on already this is pretty good. And then, yeah, you get to kind of see what it kind of looks like, or where they're at so far. You could even create your own group, and it's kind of based on... So let me just try it. Get near... Here we go. So, like, for example, I wanted to create a group. It kind of already has this in mind. And then look at that. See? So it already has an idea of basically where I am. Or that it's regular... Tri oh, okay, that's awesome. So you see, you, you see, it's like, it's very condensed. It's very uh, simple to use. And I'm just finding out about it. Oh my gosh, yes, CLO. Oh, th so that's awesome. VP, that looks pretty awesome. Oh yeah, so we can make the soup, you know. Oh, that's going on over there. Bulliots are actually very good for trading too. I know I've said that a lot, but they really are pretty awesome. Oh look, here comes a bead counter to the... just to kind of get us going here too. Makes me wish I'd save the quicksand for the level 8, but that is perfectly fine. How is this one looking? Yeah, I saw one that was like, uh, like with the, that had like an envelope or something next to it. I wonder what that means. Group leader not present. Those kind of make set. Oh wait, I forgot to hit back instead of xing out. Whoops. There is ever one that's like. It's like there's an envelope or something. I gotta figure out what that means. Crusader A, B, C, A, and D. That's funny. I'll have to look another time. I can I can understand like the green thumbs up meeting like they're there, and then they're kind of uh, grayed out thumbs up meeting. They're not there. Land Acquisition Architect. Oh yes, that's the one I was... We were struggling with way, way long ago. See, I thought, this place is just busting. Look at this. You got, you got groups going on all over the place. any others uh be really cool to do another like uh either a duck shuffler or any other type of like the new manager type cog so that would be pretty awesome to try and get to oh okay that's that's awesome
dazed and confused from the the damage from trap. That's that's a good addition. I haven't missed. Your glasses look very misty to me, if you don't mind me saying it. I feel like my lure is so close to getting uh, up there. I feel like, how far exactly is that? I know it's maybe about like 12,000. Sorry, not 12,000, 1,200. About like 12,000, that would be way too much. No, I have about 12,000 and need another uh, 1,200, which is not bad at all. So yeah, bullions are definitely uh, you know, in the conversation for that. Trap is trap, but uh, you know, otherwise we're pretty on point, and so is this cog, so we're gonna go battle them. That's the other thing I wonder. I should probably leave that tab open to see if it automatically refreshes, or do I need to like do what I've been doing, kind of like close it out in order to, you know, like refresh for. See, because one more just kind of joined in. But again, though, that could just be a matter of like, uh. Okay, wait, I'd go up reserved. Okay, they've been invited by the group later. Okay, so that's actually pretty nice. And the nice thing too is like it pretty much stays open. Except for when you teleport, uh, but, uh, and such. But you know what? That is, I find it pretty great, though, that like you can leave it open while you're roaming the street, battling cogs, and basically just kind of see like, oh, okay, what do we have here? I really need to save a preset as soon as I probably get up to here, probably, a trap. Because by that point, everything else is going to be set. Uh, I don't know, I just always hate to, like, save this preset. And then when I come back later, I accidentally save the wrong preset, or load, sorry, load the wrong preset. You know, we're saving, we're loading, we're doing all that.
Get the rake up all done. Look at all this all across the board. Okay, pretty awesome. So now more rake ups. Oh look, it's Fabio. So yeah, that's the kind of hair I was expecting. Let's do this, Fabio. Let's go. Let's. Well, I don't think I need jelly beans. How many? Uh, seven out of fourteen. How many do I get? One. So that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that would be enough. Or I could go three. Six. So there's three. Six. Let's take care of those next. And we're sadly leaving behind Fabio and all that wonderful hair. I figure first things first, we can at least take out the, uh, the tight wads. This should be a good place to try and find them. I'm all over this playground this episode. It's been a while since I've really been here on a consistent uh, basis, this playground. Oh great, here comes another. Okay, so we're uh, we're gonna need Oh that hit really hurt. I was twenty one, wow. I've lost my marbles, literally. Do you see this over here? Wow. Then watch this, I always love when they fall for it. There we go. See, the cogs are also busted with laughter. Oh, and I guess I heard jelly beads from... So that's pretty awesome. So now, yeah, we got that kind of going on. I don't know what these daily tasks are. So defeat a CEO, yeah, that's fine. Cog golf course, yeah. But then throw 25 whole fruit pies in the Cellbot Tower's rooftop. I have no idea what... Is that like when you're facing a VP and you gotta throw the pies? That, that, that's the only thing that came to mind is like in that final round where it, everything goes downhill, but you know, like literally, but at least not figuratively. You know, it's just literally downhill in the sense that you're just throwing pies and pushing the VP kind of like down the cliff. Talk about going over the edge of the am I right or something, you know, right there at the end. <laughs> but you know, like uh, no, but seriously though, like that's the only thing that really came to mind. Yeah, 
Now to throw 25 of them, though, that would probably take... Probably a second one. You could probably get away with, you know, like throwing maybe about, like... Anywhere in the range of 18 to 20, if I had a guess, like, I don't even keep track of how many I typically throw, but I'm guessing here, if I had a good guess at least, my estimate would be somewhere around... 18 to 20. I'm guessing the 25 is a number where it's like, it's just greater than the number you would typically throw in one, which makes you come back for a second in order to complete it. We could also complete three picnic table games. Look at that, it's such a nice little, it's a picnic basket. Uh, the CFO is definitely on the table to help out with this, with the mints and such. Perhaps that was meant to be this episode, you know? Oh, and I'm having really fun going around doing, like, kudos tasks, and then now that we... Well, now that I know, like, I know the look here, so now I can, uh... Get groups going for, like, the new managers and such. That would be awesome. Okay, who wants this? You do. Okay. So actually, what might work is we could pick up another task. Yes, okay, so from defeating the two executives back there, it was 44 a piece that brought us to 88 jelly beans. But then we got more jelly beans from handing in the task there, which brought us up to 142. So that was an additional, let's see, 88, 142, almost, almost 60, like 60 minus 6, maybe, probably. Yeah, so that might work. Excuse me, Fabio. Oh, awesome. New catalog. Right on time, too. Um, you know let's go with... See, it's just one of those things where it's like... Phoenix Cogs on these first couple streets here. I wonder... And yeah, there are no invasions right now, anyway. See, I was... In an ideal world, we would want, like, a mid-level invasion that... I don't think it's... Oh, no, wait, actually, it doesn't affect the first playground. And actually, how it is now, like... It, you know, affects, like, different parts of the playgrounds and such, or different areas. But still, in an ideal world, it's just kind of like, you know... These streets are kind of too low-leveled for uh, the gags I'm trying to train. We could try and go after... Where would a Swindler even be? Probably... Well, if you think about what a Swindler does... See, yeah, you always gotta think like a Swindler. Uh... One of the thing, it's like I know I'm gonna regret taking this task, but let's do it. Also, since last time, the uh, the different effects have been the of the Christmas effects have been taken down, so we're all back to normal, you know, set up uh, the visual, the audio, the. Just everything in Clash, you know, has been reverted from Christmas back to not Christmas or, you know, holiday season attire. Like, the songs are very, like, you know, holiday-y. Several of them reminded me of, like, several Christmas songs, you know, the, the tunes at least. The tunes, oh, wait. tunes for the tunes, you know? So yeah, you just have those several holiday songs kind of going on, and... But yeah, that was awesome.
Okay, this is visually very confusing. I'm somewhere here. Hey, look, I'm right back going down. Uh, I figured this might be a good place to try to look for them, but this might be too high level. So now we just gotta think, where might be a decent place to find just at a lower level board bots? I had a guess, Anchor Avenue might be a place to try. And if we can find one as an executive, all the better, because then that would help out with the Jelly Beans task, and then when we hand in the, this task, when we get the rest of the Jelly Beans. Something tells me we're going to fall a couple, just a couple shy uh, at the current mark. But on the bright side, it would be pretty close. It's pretty good. Oh, wait, there's only 10% chance for the. Oh, no, wait, there's a Swiddler. Oh, yes. So that's one down. Let's head on back. I'm gonna guess maybe Lighthouse might be a bit a better uh, place for percentage board bots. Of course, here you know you got that 10% chance that uh, you were able to find a Swiftler there. Which kind of, you know, always excites me when you find that low level percent to uh, you actually find what you need. Which always kind of reminds me, like, I wonder how they come up with uh, these percentages, you know? So, like, here's 55%, meaning this. This is uh, level 3, you know what? It's fine. It's fine, we'll just... There we go. Got out of there just in time before... That double talker could try to double talk to me. So wait, I actually think I can see how many jelly beans. 51, which, yes, yeah, not going to be enough. That's perfectly okay, though, because we can always hop out a trolley. Oh, wait, that was enough.
Someone's gonna have to help me with the math on that one. You know what? Um, who cares? We're done. And I actually think I might be ready for the rank up. I can't even remember where I'm headed. I think that's at punchline, but... Yep. Okay, so off we go. There's one right here, too. I could have got here. Okay, so perhaps you're not as hard to find as I was leading myself to believe. Which is always a good thing. You would always much rather find something than not find something. The... You know there's a high on your head. Okay, right. Uh, metaphors. Uh, those are the ones that use like, as, both those types of words, right? You know, like, it was as sunny as a uh, bright summer day, or it was like a pie was on your head. That one's not actually a metaphor, but I'm just kind of, I'm just rolling with things at this point. Happy as a clam. So yeah, that's a simile. Happy as a clam. Oh no! Please don't tell me we're gonna let, you're gonna throw that pie using your head. Why do I always have to go to people named Rick for assistance? Okay, off the loopy lane we go. That may have been trapped in Lur. I thought I heard a magnet go in here. Oh, wait a minute. I believe that's a cog building symbol. So oh, we're headed. We're headed out. Oh, man. So, yeah, as you can see, we're kind of, you know, into the new year officially now. Well, I mean, we've kind of been there for a little bit, but, you know, like, it's been almost two full weeks, almost. So, yeah, I hope everyone's been enjoying the new year so far. Is there anything you want to share that you're excited about, you know, by all means, please? Yeah, that's always, I miss it. Uh, it's always exciting to, uh, you know, share things you're excited about in the new year, things you're looking for, things you want to do, you know, those types of things. I'm, I know I'm really excited, you know. I'm always, you know, I'm always very, like, excited for the, you know, the next thing that comes up, you know. I'm, I'm not a rabbit today, at least, you know. Fridays are typically, you know, the rabbit day, but, uh, for my Uber stuff, but, uh, I am very much a optimist, you know? Defeat eight level fours. Okay, this is gonna be a pain. Let's just go do a building or something. But yeah, I'm... Actually, wait, we could actually...
That's interesting. So public, that means that that arrow must be like I can go to them. That's interesting. I was hoping for maybe like a just a two or three story just to kind of get several kind of you know out of the way here. But yeah, you know, like I'm always excited for, uh, you know, the next thing that always comes up. And I'm hoping you all are too. And, you know, you're excited for what, uh, whatever it is you have going on, you know. careful with damage I take. Could be more mindful of that on the uh, upper floors. I definitely want to try to get as much uh, trap in as possible here. Yeah, sure, well, we'll go with this. You know what else has been great, though, too, I've noticed about this is that, like, the cogs seem to be getting up and ready. Like, you know, when they come out of the elevators, for example, like, they they come out, they come prepared. They're very organized. They're very corporate-like, and we are clashing with them. animal fans by uh you know it's been strange my cat has been coming around a lot lately when i'm you know in like the place where i record uh, i have not seen her yet today she has not come in yet but she has been coming by here the past you know few uh times it's been weird because it's like sometimes she distracts me as i'm trying to talk and then it's like I'm trying to divert my attention to both this and her. And of course, you know, she, she obviously, you know, everything's about her. But yeah, it's just so strange. I have not seen her yet today. She has not yet distracted me. Oh, I'm sure she will at some point. She's very her stickity like that, I guess you could say.
Oh, this is perfect. Oh, this top floor music feels like I should really be like... Really jam it out to this right here. Okay, what do we want to call this? Uh... So this should be enough time for... Yeah, let's get the, the trap going. It's soul for you. That, okay, that's a good one. I like that. I think I have enough uh, laugh to be doing this. Okay, let's go. A good experience. I like that. Like both did a crap and uh, blur. That's right. Gag me up, Mr. Building. Actually, I do need or gags out of it, I bet you that. So I am going to head on back. That's some really good stuff right there. Very good progress. And only four steps left, so that's pretty good. So here we go. One, two, three, four. That should be done. No, just kidding. I know we got to head out back. Took out about plenty of them. Wait, you don't want friends? Is that what you just said? I want to be your friend. It's like that song, Why Can't We Be Friends? We're going to start breaking out into the chorus, aren't we? Alright, back to punchline we go. At least I think that's where we're going. It's 
It's always important. You know, I always forget to check. Oh, I should. You. Uh, no, but like I sometimes, I guess you'd say sometimes, you know, forget to be like, oh, you know, like, uh, is the building on the street I need to go to actually available or is it a cog building, you know? So it's always important to look at that. And it's always important to see, like, location so you don't, uh, because what if I ever got past a building, you know? I ignore the every episode in which I do that. But anyway, excellent. Here we are. Oh, it's it's like a kite, in other words, so you know another simile. Okay, defeat five. This should not be that difficult. I mean, it's mainly just going to be a bunch of low-level. Uh, cogs, we will be defeated here. Of course, if we can find any level 4s, that would be awesome. Try to help us with the, the training out here. Oh, wow, we got a lot going on here. It's a mouthpiece. Gatekeeper, I wonder if they have anything to report. Yeah, okay, so that's the other thing, like, with, the uh, With the, uh, oh, what are they called? The, uh, new managers and such. Like, I would love to try them all on. I don't know if it's best to start them out while... Uh... Like, I, I don't know if you guys all want to see the, uh... The sheer amount of uh, effort it's going to take for me to try and figure out what the best thing is to do the very first time. Especially considering I'm... Uh, oh, whatever that's called, where it's like you're... Like, uh, where your laugh and gags are all kind of, uh... Reduced. I was going to say removed, but it's like they're not removed, they're just greatly reduced. Of course, it is all kind of set up to where it's like, you can. Probably get away with, you know, a little bit of it here. Then again, though, it's like we're already kind of past the 50-minute mark, and I'm guessing a battle's going to take uh, several different minutes. Of course, you know, the uh, the other one wasn't that difficult either. Like, the, when I did the Duck Shuffler here, that maybe only took a few rounds, you know? There wasn't that bad at all. We all kind of had an idea going into it where it was like, uh, like, lure and throw, and obviously because it had to be the same turn, because with the lure that you had available for you, at least in this one, it just wasn't, uh, you, know, you weren't able to sustain it for multiple rounds. It was like that round and that was it. It'd be interesting to see how it works in other manager battles, you know. But yeah, definitely maybe next time. That'd be something I'd like to do next time. Try to take a look around at uh, something and hopefully be somewhat uh, successful at it. I mean, a lot of it could just be boiled down to you know, like using lure and throw against the manager at the same turn, or um, squirt and zap combos. Because especially early on, like take a look at like the early trap damages they're good but you would get a lot more out of it if you had one lure and uh, like three throw if that was available <laughs> hey it's a three throw it's a three throw not a free throw how about that 
But uh, or if you did what, or if you did squirt and zap combos, or you know, th those seem, seem to be uh, working the best. All right, let's fly. Let's take off. That's perfect. Go defeat more. Take, you know, if you're worried about like, why can't we take this up with like air traffic control or something? Is it, aren't there people who regulate you know, like what what can and cannot be flown out here or something? And it's still missed. Oh, uh, this takes me back. I understand they all have to be here in Two Town Central. I just kind of wish uh, there was a building or something. One down, I had to go. Actually, what we could do. It's just something weird where it's just like, you know, I, I like buildings for some reason. It always just kind of seems like, even if it doesn't like take, uh, even if, for example, it did not take a shorter amount of time, significantly shorter, it just, there's just something satisfying about seeing all of them, you know, tallied at once. As opposed to like one here, one there. Especially if you could find a building. There's a two story, that's fine. I feel like. Oh, okay, so I guess that one is fine. I wonder why the... I thought it was. Take it. You know, it doesn't matter, but if you do this, especially if you can get like four of them lined up at once, three or four cogs, uh, the sound, and then you're able to take out multiple cogs at the same time and get that all kind of leveled up, or, well, the task at least, you know, handled properly. It just seems more efficient. See, like, this is awesome. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Time to cash in on some rewards. But yeah, I will say overall this update has been pretty, pretty amazing, you know. Uh, so yeah, if anyone wants to share their favorite part of the update, for sure, definitely, because there's a lot going on, you know, it's just so amazing the amount they were able to accomplish with all of this, so definitely, yeah, anything to share, please go ahead. And of course, if there's anything else that, you know, like while I'm uh, recording here, if there's anything, you know, you want me to talk about, I know I typically mainly go on about... Uh, Typically, you know, like clash type stuff, uh, the things going on in the game, the things I kind of like it as I'm going around here. But yeah, I'm free to talk about basically anything that's, uh, anything that's like pertinent, appropriate, relevant, anything really. Like, yeah, you, know, you heard me talk about my cat a little bit ago, you know. I do like cats, I like dogs, you know. All animals, really. You know, they're all pretty basic. Yeah, really good to, you know, like, 
yeah, talk about anything, anything I read in the comments, really, that's, you know, like, awesome like that. It's, but yeah, I'm really good to discuss pretty much anything. You know, we're all just here to kind of relax for, like, at the hour or so I record this. Which does remind me, we just got went over the hour mark, I can see, so... I'm hoping we're near the end of this, because this would be a great place to stop. Yes, I see one step left, so this seems like a great place. So awesome. Oh yes, 30% on gags. But locked a booster slot. Okay, what kind of boost are we talking here? Is this like, you know, when you when you add an extra espresso into your coffee? Because I do not do that. No, let me tell you. Espresso, you definitely do not want. Oh, that, that is too much for me. Like, I am sorry. Like, if anyone could have espresso, good for you. That is... That stuff is just way too intense for me. Yeah, so this is how we're looking. Not looking pretty good, if you ask me. And I don't think there are any, uh, whoops. Did this update? No, it did not update. It's going to reset. Okay, yeah, we still have a long time to go before it resets. No, not what I meant to do. We're turning the camera, so... It's that bittersweet time where I have to say goodbye again. But you know what? I appreciate you watching uh, this. I appreciate you, you know, supporting me all throughout the video series. Let's look at the... Four. But yeah, we still have a long way to go. But And I don't think I'm going to pick up any of these. I'm going to wait to see if any... Uh... What I found is that you can get a lot of efficiency out of the gold and silver kind of combined tasks. But anyway... I hope you've enjoyed. Let's take, let's pan out, take a look. Look at that, you can see the two town in there in the background. Hold it up, you know, hold up the side. I wish I could, is there an emotion that can hold up the side? I wish I could do, like if you could stand back here and like do the wave, and have the wave somehow holding up the two town letters in the back. That would be a cool pose. Anyway though. Thank y'all so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. I hope you had fun watching. And I will see you next time for more Corporate Clash. Oh yeah.